These are the hands of your best friend, young, strong and full of love for you, that are holding yours on your wedding day, as you promise to love each other today, today, tomorrow and forever. These are the hands that will work alongside yours as together you build your future. These are the hands that will passionately love you and cherish you through the years and with the slightest touch will comfort you like no other. These are the hands that will tenderly hold your children. These are the hands that will help you to hold your family as one. These are the hands that will give you strength when you need it. And lastly, these are the hands that even when wrinkled and aged, will still be reaching for yours, still giving you the same unspoken tenderness with just a touch. Hello everyone. I know that it is Hi. <laughs> I know that it isn't very traditional for the bride to make a speech, but I couldn't miss the opportunity to thank everyone here today and rave about my new husband. <laughs> Honey has always been a true romantic from day one, buying me cheap energy drinks on the way to school, which was pretty much the pinnacle of teenage romance. And staying on FaceTime with me after an episode of Criminal Minds to make sure I would fall asleep without feeling scared. <laughs> Ten years on, he continues to ensure I feel happy and secure every day through little thoughtful actions like making me a hot cuppa and writing me poems and cards on special occasions, all the while supporting me in my goals and making sure our little family can live the best life possible. Honey, do you wish to take Bethany to be your lawful wedded wife? Do you promise to love and care for her support and comfort her through good times and bad, today and forever. I do. Bethany, do you wish to take Annie to be your lawful wedded husband? Do you promise to love and care for him, support and comfort him through good times and bad, today and forever? I cherish every single moment I spend with Hanny, where we are able to be our absolute true selves and there are no covers for emotions, no filters for words, and we have the ability to be completely carefree. When I refer to Hanny as my other half, I truly mean that he is my other half, as it is only when I'm with him that I feel completely whole. I promise that I will respect and care for you, be loyal to you, and above all, love and cherish you throughout our lives together. Honey and Bethany, you have both made the declarations required by law and have made solemn and binding promises to each other in the presence of your witnesses, family and friends. You have also symbolized your marriage by the joining of hands and the giving and receiving of rings. May the feelings of love that you have for each other deepen and grow ever stronger throughout the years to come. It therefore gives me very great pleasure to declare that you are now husband and wife. hilariously funny and we both have a sense of humour so dark that we realise that if we made the same jokes to anyone else they may never speak to us again but he makes me laugh until I have to tell him to stop because my cheeks hurt. Honey, you are my soulmate and my embodiment of home within a person. I can't believe that I get to call myself your wife. I've been blessed to have spent so much of my life so far with you as my partner and I look forward to loving you for the lifetime to come. Thank you for being you and loving me like you do. So, please could you raise your glasses to my incredible husband, Hanny. To Hanny. <laughs>
is your day to remember, as long as you both shall live. This is your day to cherish, when to each other you give. A promise to love one another through troubles, illness or strife. And I'm sure if you keep these promises, you'll both have a wonderful life.